Yo, highly welcome my dear brothers and sisters out there. I'm glad that you just clicked to watch this message today. Today I'm going to be talking about the reason why you see the whole world confused in the religion of a mother with a child. And the reason why you see a lot of them depicting it in their different religion organization places where they are worshipping those them idols which they have already made out. So, you need to go to the root of all this to be able to really understand the reason why these things are being depicted in that form. Because you need to understand that there are some people who are out there who do not believe on virgin birth. The reason is because they don't understand, they don't see the mystery, they don't know the reason why the virgin birth is of a necessity. And this is something that I would like us to check into because you need to know that if you don't know the base of the reason why things are happening to you, it might sound foolishness. But when you understand the basic knowledge, when you understand, when you know the mystery, when you know the base knowledge of why things are happening the way they are happening, then things will start to make sense. Although others, to others, it might be foolishness, but to you, it is something that you will sit back there and you are shedding and you are nodding your head. Because you understand the mystery of the things which is happening. And this is the reason why you need to be able to really be inclined in the knowledge of truth. When you see people who are talking about trying to say things that, uh, um, that they do not understand about the virgin birth, you need to be able to really see and know that these people are still babes. They've not grown and they need to be nurtured. And this is the reason why I want to just take this brief time to be able to really elevate and expand a bit about what happened thousands and thousands of years before you even came into this planet and this knowledge is something that has been it is already re recorded also in the scripture you need to be able to really understand it your eyes need to be open to be able to really grab it and see it from this perspective now the reasons why you see samaramosis or you see a mother being depicted with a baby with a child is something that happened in the ancient time and I'm bringing it to be able to, in this contemporary time, I'm bringing it from the ancient time to be able to bring it into this contemporary time to give you the mystery of what that thing really is. So that you will see and know the reason why it is happening and know the reason why it is of necessity that the virgin birth has to take place. Now, thousands of years ago, something happened and that is the husband of Big Mama Big mama that I'm talking about is the mother of living. Now, thousands of years ago, thousands and thousands of years before you were born on this planet, the husband of big mama went on a very distant journey. Now, this distant journey that baby that the husband of big mama did, the husband stayed long time and delayed his coming back. So, this is the wife, the big mama is the wife of the husband, just normal. And now what happened is, as the husband has gone on a very distant journey, the wife has waited, the big mama have waited, and her husband was not returning. So now what happened is, big mama needed to do something because she can no longer wait her patient is being you know she can no longer wait for her husband i mean when she was supposed to be waiting her, for her husband no matter how long her husband has stayed away but me big mama was not able to do that because big mama patient was exhausted so now what happened big mama who is the mother of all living now, since she could no longer wait for her husband to return, because her husband went on a very far journey. Since she could no longer wait for, you know, you need to understand the basic. You need to understand that the husband, while she was with Big Mama, she was restricting Big Mama on some certain things. Ah, oh, Big Mama, you don't have to do this in this form. I want you to do it in this form. In my own way, the way I want it to be is the better way. Do it this form. But, Big Mama was feeling restricted by the husband. So Big Mama was looking for an opportunity for the husband to be away. So the moment the husband went away, 
Big Mama now saw an opportunity to explore and do what she always wanted to do. So now what happened is, as soon as the husband went on this journey, now Big Mama now saw a very good opportunity for her to establish her own way that she always wanted to do. So now what happened is, Big Mama, who has already given birth with what? With her husband. She had children with her husband. And now while the husband is away, Big Mama did what? Big Mama now went on and slept with one of her own son. And now, when Big Mama slept with one of her own son, while the husband was not around, the husband is on a very far journey, on a distance journey. So now, remember what I said. That Big Mama was finding it difficult because the husband is restricting her from some certain things. So she needed to do what? Now that the husband is away, and a very distance journey, Big Mama wanted to establish something that is different from what the husband used to Used, used, you know, used to control. You know, how the husband used to control things. So now the moment the husband is away, what happened? Big Mama now went and did what? And slept with one of her son. And now when Big Mama slept with one of her son, a child, another son was being born. Another son that was being born, it is the one that is called Tammuz. And this Tammuz is now a child, a son that has been born through an intercourse that Big Mama had with her own son. And now another son was being produced. You see, Big Mama is causing a very big confusion in the world. So now, remember all these things are taking place while the husband is not around. So now, Big Mama now has produced an offspring a son which she can be able to do what to control and now this son that she has produced which she can be able to control she is now doing what controlling this son that she's that she has done what that she has produced because this son now is coming from a different line be because this is not from what this is not from the husband directly that this child is coming from so but peep mama your husband is not around what happened when the husband came back from the distance journey, you need to understand what is going on. When the husband came back from the journey, the husband saw something strange. Big mama, what have you done? What have you done? You've just, this, uh, this is your son that you just slept with. Big mama, what have you done? Big mama broke the heart of her husband. Big Mama broke the heart. I mean, she broke the heart of her husband because the husband just came back. And what did the husband? What did what did the husband just see? The husband just saw that what Big Mama has slept with her own son. Big Mama, what have you done? So the husband was so pissed because of the action of Big Mama. Now the child that has been that is being born by Big Mama, which is Tammuz, this child now is now doing what is now making more is now gaining more ground to be able to challenge the, the real children of the husband. So and this child that is being born, which is Tammuz by Big Mama, this child is being used by Big Mama to control everything that is what that is on the earth. And now the sons of the real husband are there too. Who knows what is really going on? So what happened? The husband was so pissed by what by what Big Mama had done. And now it is now time for the husband to do what? To do something because this has caused a lot of confusion in the earth. Because if you see, number one of this confusion is the bloodline originally was coming from the husband, 
Because one of the sons of the husband was the same one that Big Mama took. The son, one of the son from Adam was the same one that what that Big Mama took and did what and slept with that and gave birth to another son. And now the whole mixing of things has occurred. So there is what confusion everywhere. Blood versus this one mixed against this one. This one mixed. Everything is now mixed. So now there has to be. The husband now needed to make a decision. And what is the decision? The decision is that. Since Big Mama has her own, has her, her own seed. The husband now decided to do what? To also bring forth his own seed. His own children. His own pure seed that are not tainted by what by the mix of the things which big mama has done so now what happened is you need to be able to really incline and see the father which is the husband now is now doing what mapping everything in order to do what in order to bring forth his own seed also the way big mama did so now his own is on a straightforward seed and in order to do that, he does not need no man. He does not need no woman to be born. You know, his children, his own seed does not need no man or woman to do what? To be able to materialize. Because the man and the woman all belongs to what? All are under now the control of what? Of Big Mama. So now what happened is, the, the one that it has to come, his own children, his own seed, which needs to come forth now, need to come forth Neither from the man nor from the woman. It has to be a seed that is going to be planted, and that seed is going to do what is going to spring forth. Is only needed a vessel to be able to do what to materialize on this planet. This is the reason why you see Big Mama being depicted everywhere with baby, with with a child, is to show you that this is to show you that this child, which is Tammuz, belongs to Big Mama. You need to understand what is happening. So the father or the husband needed also to do what to produce his, his own seed so that his own children can also can be independent. So now there is what there has to be two. Because this one that has been mixed by Big Mama, the seed of the husband needed to come forth and is going to be what is going to be pure, untinted. From the seed, from the children of what of Big Mama, and that is the reason why he spoke his words. He spoke his word. That is why you need to understand that when Yahushua came forth, that is the word that came forth that materialized, and that word that materialized is the word that was coming from what from eternity. That is to say, the word that is coming from the Father. Now, when the word came forth. That word now became flesh. The word does not need no husband, no, no male, no female in order to do what, in order to material, in order to materialize the intercourse. That sexual intercourse is not needed. It only needed a vessel through which he can materialize in this in this world, in this earth, in order to do what to bring forth his own seed. That was the quickening. The quickening man that is going to do what? That is going to bring forth that seed. That is going to bring forth that seed. In that form. And those beings which are born in that form are not tinted in any form. You don't understand what is happening. When you go in ancient Kemi, the reason why you see them depicting those things is because Big Mama did the undoable. Big Mama did. Big Mama went and slept with her own, ch with her own children. With her own son. And produce another son, which is causing too much problem, too much confusion on the planet Earth. So the husband needed to produce his own seed, and his own seed is the one that is going to do what is is already on the making. That is why the Yahushua has to come forth. That was the word that was be spoken. And everyone that comes to him, that goes to him, is no longer an, an ordinary being, but what, but a spirit being which belongs to what to the Father. There is a distinction now between what the seed. Of the woman and what and the seed of what of the husband so because there has to be that distinction 
So you're here now talking. You need to understand. Yes, the, her hus the husband of Big Mama love her so much, but she's been distant. I mean, she is she is astray because she don't. I mean, you need to understand that she has gone because she was not able to wait for the come for the return of her husband. But all these things are being played in the way so that the earth will be in the way in the state of which it is right now. And I thank the Most High Yahuwah and our Heavenly Father through what big, big Alma Mama. You know, because that has really put in the word in the place where it is supposed to be in the sense that when you understand the reason why those things need to happen in that form, this has not, nothing to do with what trying to make you to, 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 to think something negative about Big Mama, but it's just to give you the understanding of what went on. Things has happened already, like I said. The husband still loves her, 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 his wife. No matter what she did, was shameful, was unbearable, I mean, was so painful. It was a disappointment to the husband. But life goes to go on. You, you need to understand it. So now, you need to understand that these are the mysteries, for example, when it comes to... When you hear in the Bible, what does the Bible say? Among those who are born of a woman. Everyone that was being born through a woman. The woman has her own seed. You got to wake up. I give you mysteries in this world. I give you mysteries in eternity. I give you mysteries everywhere I am. Everywhere I go. Because it is in me. The Bible makes us to understand that anybody that is born of a woman, there has never risen anyone greater than John the Baptist. There has never risen anyone greater than John the Baptist. John the Baptist, every last one of them, all these them people who have been born through a woman. But the Bible makes us to understand that the list in the kingdom of Yahushua, the list in the kingdom of the Father is greater than what? Than the greatest of the one that was being born through a woman. You don't understand the mysteries of the book, right? You need to wake up. You need to start seeing things in a different dimension and not be stuck with what? With your own, with the doctrine of what Big Mama has taught other ones. That is the problem a lot of people were having, are having. Because Big Mama now was trying to do what? Was trying to melt down the things that the husband would not allow her to go in a direction so she's now melting down the whole thing and make it more more um, slow and say oh you can do it this way you can do it that way when the husband was strictly on no when he said no that is fine there is no such thing as smoothly petting you or something like that where the husband is he does things the way he wants it to be and that is why he wanted it the way but me mama had a problem had issues along the line with what with the way that her husband was was controlling things so she had established her own and look at how the whole thing is very soft very soft very soft it is time to tear the whole thing down in order to bring forth the children the seed the purest seed on the face of the earth you need to understand what is happening this is just a token this is just part one of this video I'm going to be talking and I'm going to be expounding on this issue and be able to really give you the understanding of the mysteries of the things which is contained in the book to all these damn people who do not understand the mystery of the virgin birth I mean to them it is not given to know the mystery of the kingdom of Allah him the kingdom of the father because you are still uh, you are still under your mother you are still under your mother what you know nothing about what she did even before this time you are still you are still born of a woman so how can you understand the things of the highest if I tell you about earthly things and you believe it not, how much more if I tell you about the heavenly things? How much more if I tell you about the things that are happening in the heavenly places of where we are coming from? And if you have eyes and you can't see, and you have those who are out here telling you the truth and you still have problem accepting it,